Okay, now we're going to take a look at system hacking. I know you're like, well, what was all that we were talking about before? And that was all hacking too, but this is getting into what you might have been looking for with hacking. This actually wraps up the last portion of the cycle. What we're going to do is we're going to go through several things in this module. We're going to go into password cracking, we're going to go into escalating privileges, we're going to go into the whole hiding files, maintaining access, and lastly covering tracks. So a whole big thing. So buckle in, get ready, let's get to work. What we want to do here is we want to take a look at all of the different components here and when we've really planned our attack, make our jump into that dangerous area. So how we do that is we're going to go through a regular set. We're going to go through password cracking. We're going to go through password attacks. We're going to take a look at identifying the various password cracking tools. We're going to take a look at coming up with countermeasures for password cracking. Then we get into the escalating privileges. When we're escalating privileges, what we're saying is I've got a user account. Now can I get administrative access with that account? We'll take a look at executing applications, which is the whole activity process here. With that, we start getting into keyloggers and spyware. We we'll start taking a look at the things we can do for countermeasures on those. Then we get into hiding files. There's actually a lot of really cool things in there with hiding files that you can do. NTFS streams are something that a lot of people don't use as effectively as they could. We'll take a look at understanding rootkits. Then we'll get into steganography. And then lastly, covering tracks.